welcome back. And this week's About Your Retirement, we've got a good viewer question. A lot we of do. families of viewer asked, Jim, we too are now researching a safer place for my mom to live. She's 87 and recently fell in her home since she was alone. It was very scary for her. She wants to remain there until we can all agree where she will move to live. What are things you've said in the past we should tell her if she falls again? Yes, great question. And we get this a lot because it happens so much to so many people, Tevis, and, and it's not just people that are 87 and up. It's one of the top five threats to anyone age 65 and up. And so it's, it's very important that you follow some, some guidelines. But the first thing is, I think it's always important to, to figure out, well, why is mom falling? And most likely when a loved one confesses that I fail, they've probably fallen before. And uh, this time it scared her and she decided to confess that and uh, what do I need to do? And so um, about a third of the falls, most of us that, that work in this field agree they're environmental, which, you know, maybe you move a piece of furniture, you get a new piece of furniture, you leave a box of decorations out you haven't put away yet, you trip over them in the dark. But it's the two-thirds that I get most concerned about. And those range from dizziness to balance issues. Those are caused by one of two things, bad nutrition, not eating well, and especially not taking your medications as prescribed by your physician or missing them. Or maybe your physician recommends a new uh, medication and says, take a couple of days and get used to this and you don't do it. So let's look at what's important to do if you fall. The first thing is, is to remain calm. And that's easier said than done sometimes, but you need to take a deep breath, get your bearings and think about getting help a telephone, whatever. And then the second thing is to assess if you're injured. It's so easy as our bodies mature and as we age, the older we are, bones are a little more fragile. Fractures are easier to get in the hips, the, the legs, the knees, the ankles, the wrists when you fall. Have a pre-programmed phone. And uh, I believe you should have an extension in every major room that you live in. And there's four or five of those, bathroom, kitchen, living room, bedroom. And then uh, the other thing is, is to consider an emergency call system. That's a little remote, push a button and uh, emergency helps on the way. But pre-program those numbers in so that uh, you just push a button and teach mom how to do that. Absolutely, Jim, thank you. And don't forget you can get more retirement advice from Jim, visit news9.com slash retirement. From the Bob Mills West